Hello, sports fan. This is Stephen Hill for JustMyPicks.com, and I'm bringing you a very special breakdown of the Panthers taking on the Titans for the Week 10 breakdown. But before I get right into that, I want to make sure you're subscribed to my YouTube channel. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can debate with us and get all our updates each and every week. Uh, hopping right into the action, Carolina Panthers beat the Green Bay Packers last week in a phenomenal game. You look at Cam Newton, how he was able to use his wide receivers, he was able to use his legs, he was able to use his running backs. This was one of the, the games where the defense is gelled, uh, the defensive players gelled, excuse me, the offensive players gelled, and it was a thing of beauty. They destroyed the Green Bay Packers, even gave the little kid the ball after uh, Julius Peppers was a little big bitch. Um, and you're looking overall at what the breakdown is for this game. Tennessee Titans went into New Orleans and got the job done. Under Ken Wilson Hunt, I think the offense was a little more stagnant. They didn't give the proper play calls. Mike Malarkey made the game simple for Marcus Mariota. He opened the playbook a little bit uh, that Ken Wilson Hunt had, but he also put in a little bit of his wrinkles. You could see the same kind of wrinkles he had when he was the head coach of the Jacksonville Jaguars with that regime with Maurice Jones Drew and things like that. But overall, you have to look at this Carolina Panthers team as being the dominant team coming into this game. I know the Titans are, people say that, oh, they're finished, their year's over. But these guys are playing passionately. They're still playing for contracts. They're still playing for roster spots. If you want to be a Tennessee Titan next year, you better play your ass off this year. So I think that you're seeing a, 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 a change in the guard, if you will. Marcus Mariota is slowly winning this football team over. You're seeing that some of the play calling that they have. Delaney Walker is playing exceptionally well at the tight end position. They're putting the intricate pieces together for this Titans team to be built back up so they can have a successful season. The Carolina Panthers are going to have a tough time in this game because I think that their defense is feisty in Tennessee. I think that the Titans have a feisty set of corners. They do have Griffin and Safety, who is a thumper. You do have people People like Brian and Rackpo who can make plays all in the uh, linebacker field and he can put his hand in the dirt and be a defensive end also. So you have a very versatile group of guys for the uh, Tennessee Titans defense. But I'm picking the Carolina Panthers because I believe Cam Newton will get the job done in the end. No matter if he has to do it by air, by foot, he will get the job done. He will move the chains and he'll do it with a big old smile. So I'm picking the Carolina Panthers to win this football game against the Tennessee Titans in the Tennessee. I think it'll be a close game. You're looking at a 24 417 type game, but I think that overall the Titans they're improving, but they're not going to win this football game this Sunday. So, all you Titans fans, Panthers fans, leave your comments in the comment section below. Also, check out justmypicks.com for all the breaking news, all the hottest updates in sports. And as always, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, share my videos, and we'll be back next week with week 11. Thank you so very much, and enjoy your day.